Of course, big question, should they play? WBZ's Mike Sullivan spoke with a psychiatrist who says it depends. It's the hit that stunned the sports world, left the NFL at a standstill, left players grasping for answers. We have to protect people as people, and then, you know, the performance aspect comes later. DeMar Hamlin is still fighting for his life. The Bills' safety collapsed in the field Monday night following a hit. The situation forced the game to be suspended and players to be visibly emotional. It's not a trophy, it's not the check. You know, um, one of our brothers, one of our teammates is, you know, is fighting for his life. David Marsh is a mental performance coach working with players at the professional, collegiate, and amateur levels. You know, especially from an organizational level, is checking your players as humans first, not as employees. This weekend, the Bills remain set to play the Patriots at 1 o'clock. The question is, will they be ready? If you do play the game and you're not focused 100% on the task at hand in the moment, that's a split second that the competitive advantage is lost. It also opens the door to injury if a player is hesitant. It's a split second that you're taking your mind off of the technique which you've trained for that keeps you safe. While Marsh believes some players may not be ready, others may need the game to cope. You know, a lot of people use sports to escape sports or therapy. You get really good at performing only what it is you're doing in the moment. And so the world around you is, is it's out there. There's a bubble, an invisible bubble. It's easy to put on that tough guy act. Pretend like you're unbreakable. But on Monday, we saw vulnerability. It's important, you know, well, we're people. We have to be healthy. We have to let things out of the small space that is our head. He would suggest organizations check in with each player individually. Really getting a good pulse on each individual's social emotional status situation to see if they are ready to hit the field by sunday in boston i'm mike sullivan wbz news